My name is Claudine Roos. I'm from the Faculty of Natural and Agricultural Sciences, School of Geospatial Sciences, and I am the recipient of the University Teaching Excellence Awards. My participation in the University Teaching Excellence Awards has allowed me to purposefully reflect on my student engagement, teaching and learning practice, the context of my classroom and the modules that I present, and also my contributions to scholarship of teaching and learning. The process has allowed me to identify the areas where I am doing well, but also most importantly, I could actively seek for areas for future improvement. I believe that mentorship plays a very important role towards participation in the teaching awards. During my participation in the University Teaching Excellence Awards, I was supported by my directors, and I also received support from um, colleagues and academic mentors within the School of Geospatial Sciences and also the Unit for Environmental Sciences and Management. The CTL Awards team also provided an enabling, supporting environment. In future, I would definitely support colleagues participating in the NWU Teaching Awards by providing mentorship and guidance where it's possible. My excellent or rather unique contribution to teaching and learning was my role in developing and presenting programs with specialization in waste management at the Northwest University. In 2013, the Department of Science and Technology as part of the Waste Roadmap process has identified insufficient tertiary education, specifically focusing on waste management as one of the biggest gaps in the waste sector. The NWU is the only university in South Africa which offers a master's degree in environmental management with specialization in waste management. The degree focuses on providing work integrated learning and has also been reported to have significantly contributed to human capital development within the waste sector over the past five years. My biggest lesson learned is how important it is to strike a balance between teaching and learning and research. In an ideal world, our research should supplement what we teach in the classroom and then our lessons learned in the classrooms should feed back into our research. My participation in the UTR has afforded me an opportunity to actively reflect on my teaching practices, which is something that we don't always get time for in a normal academic year. Usually we learn from our students' reflections or feedback on our teaching and learning. While my participation in the awards has allowed me to take a step back and reflect on my own teaching and learning practices. I would encourage anyone considering participation in the NWU Teaching Awards to do so. It's well worth the effort. My tips to prospective participants would be, firstly, be honest in your reflections. My director once told me, tell them what you believe and not what you think they want to hear. Secondly, focus on showcasing what makes your program or your module unique or stand out. And lastly, be critical, but also be kind to yourself. Recognize where you are performing well as a lecturer and share that with others.